Look at those legs. Look at those legs. But do you know what time it is? It's Christmas light time. <laughs> Yeah! Woo! It's a warm day out there today. Oh, yeah! Look at that. We want to use them all. All of them. All of them. And we had enough to go all the way around our house at the old place with this. And that was a big house to go all the way around, so we should have plenty for here. And we had enough of these icicles to go along the front of our house. So we should almost have enough to go all the way around here, I think. Mm. Okay, let's get started. Take out one at a time. Test them, get them all ready to go. We should be playing some Christmas music, I'm just saying. I am disappointed in us. We only have one outdoor outlet right by the door here. So we've got to get this somehow up there to there where the lights are going to be. And I guess we'll go that way and that way. Come on, boys. Want to come help me get the, the cords? So the temperature outside is plus four Celsius, probably around about 40 Fahrenheit in our high 30s. It's a warm day today. We're going to use today get as much done as we can all right diesel we're gonna need frosty over here i need to take him out watch his head watch his head all right come on frosty get out of here where's your nose oh no where'd your nose go we'll have to find his nose all right i don't want them to pee on this guy i'm gonna take him out here he's probably going on the front deck i'm guessing can find his nose. I guess he could be a frosty without a nose. Wouldn't be the same though. All right, now we got frosty out there. Let's go get what we actually went back there for. There's all the snow is disappearing. This is great. All right. This extension cord. Christmas is just around the corner. Coming up. Just around the bend. Why? 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 Get this stick. Just around the bend. Good boy, Shabby. I guess we probably shouldn't be teaching him this. This is what he did when he was a puppy with my mom's tree. Good boy, Diesel. We're cutting this one down anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Probably not a good habit, but it's so cute. Get it, Diesel. Chevy, get it. Get this one right here. This one right here. Get it. Everybody oh my goodness, Nisa. And we've got the shake bug life. Well, we got the first strand up. And it goes from over there, halfway down the house. It almost went like a quarter way all the way around the house. We're gonna have tons of lights left over. Started here. Now I'm gonna go that way and I'm gonna have the little sensor right there above those lights there. He's gonna have to have them closer now, eh? Oh, 
I gotta figure this out yet. So I gotta have the sensor plugged in here. This is our only outlet outside, like I said, so. Heh, we'll figure it out. You guys wanna hang up the rest of them for me? Thanks. Believe in you. You can do it. So we hung up two strings, two strings, hung up two strings, and that was half the house already. So we've started over here by the main door outside here. Went all the way around the front of that corner there, just two strings. And I think we have something like 14 strings or something. Something ridiculous like that. We got a lot to do. And the icicles, I have an idea for them. It's in here. It's in here. You can't know it yet, but it's in here. So we'll spend 10 minutes. Are you done? They didn't get anything done. I see your comments when you're all comparing me to Cousin Ed with his hat. This is my absolute favorite hat. And it's a Chevy hat too. It's my favorite hat. I love it. Suits me well, I think. Okay, so we got around the front of the house and the side, half the side of the house. We want to get at least around the back and this side here. That side is very close to that house over there. So if I don't get that done, not the end of the world. I don't care. Isn't there a Chevy out here somewhere too? Diesel, where's your brother? Chevy! Oh, there he is. Hey, no barking. Diesel. No barking. None of that. I'm gonna put you inside. Control yourself. difficult to do because you hang up one and the next one pops off. See, I use these little clips. They're very nice because they, they attach onto the shingles on the side of the house and also onto the gutters here. It's just that they, when you hang one up and the others want to pop off. We gotta twist it just right. A long way to go. See, these are the clips that I was showing you before. They're very handy. But they also break easy when they get cold, and they're very frustrating. See, they can either hook onto the gutter like that, and it holds it in the gutter, or you go under the shingles like that, or over if you want. So it can attach to pretty much anything. That's why I bought a whole bunch of them. It's like seven bucks for a hundred of them or something. I got them last year and I just left them on here. I probably used way too many, a little overkill, but eh, works pretty good. I'm almost done. <laughs> this house is a lot easier to decorate. It's amazing how much happier we are with a smaller house. There's less to do.
Of course, those clips start giving me the most trouble right at the peak. Of course. Makes sense, right, Diesel? Makes sense. Don't hurt yourself, man. Don't hurt yourself. So we didn't feel like making anything tonight, but we ordered Santa Lucia pizza for delivery. And they gave us garlic toast along with this order, and uh, I didn't know it was coming, but I'll take it. Look at that. They gave us half a loaf. It's not as garlicky as I thought it would be. Very <laughs> bland. Maybe the garlic's in the middle. Yeah, maybe I'll get to it, yeah. That was a big piece of garlic toast, though. Yikes! <laughs> Alright, watch out, Diesel. You gotta stay in here. I huh? almost squished your head. Turn off this light here. Okay, you know this camera does awful at night, but I wanna show you these lights. Alright. There we go. I know it doesn't show very well, but. There you go. There's that uh, yard light that I hung up there. Works very good. It's not that bright, but it does enough so we can see where we're going. I still need to finish around that corner over there, but there we go. And it's not done yet. We have to hang up the icicles yet. So we got work to do tomorrow. What's going on in here? Britt has found a Christmas show. What is this? So after looking at Jeff Senior's collection, he makeover holiday home makeover. Oh, so it's like one of those home makeover shows, but it's a Christmas edition. We're gonna expand. It's Christmas decorating. thing today has been fantastic for me. Thank you so much. I'm really getting a feel for how much Jeff Senior meant to his family. You guys watch this stuff? It's on Netflix. He's friendly. I just set up the Christmas lights in the house today, and I already feel extremely inferior. Have to do more wow, I got a long way to go to meet these guys. Wow, I feel kind of depressed. Like, look at that. Just got like one little string on the house. I was all excited. Not anymore. Now I feel like I got nothing done. So, what do you think there, Big Frank? What do you think? I didn't kill myself. Such a shame. I still got some more to do though. So I just want to wrap this up. Yesterday was not much of a going about day, but we are in lockdown, so there's not much we can go about and do, except hang up Christmas lights. And again, I, I, I have to give the disclaimer, American Thanksgiving still hasn't happened yet, but I'm not an American. I'm a Canadian. Our Thanksgiving's in October. They've really got to get used to this. Yes, Every I know. Every year it's like they're in shock. Guys, <laughs> we're, we are a different culture. I know that we're similar, but we are a different culture. Yeah, very similar, but Not the I, same. I think we like Christmas a little more because Santa is from Canada. He's from Germany. No, he's from the North Pole. He no, lives in Canada. Just because he lives in the North Pole, technically he's German. He's German? Yes. Oh, he's a German-Canadian, just like us. Maybe I'm Santa. <laughs> I'm just going to leave that thought in your head. You never know. You never know. Maybe I'm Santa. I got the beard. I mean, maybe it just turns white. You guys have watched the Santa Claus, right? You know, sometimes they base movies on a little bit of truth. <laughs> Tim Allen played me very well, I think. I'd say. I'd say. They even made a sequel. Two of them, right? Two of them. There's three <gasps> Santa Clauses. We should watch them. Do we have them? We have the first one. I used to have the second one. I'm sure we could find them on Netflix or Disney Plus. Disney Plus probably has it. Mm-hmm. I know what we're doing tonight. <laughs> so anyways, yeah, I, I like to remind them of that because the majority of my viewers are from the US. That's the biggest audience because they're, they got a big population and they do their Thanksgiving at the end of November uh, for some reason. That's just the way they do it. We do our Thanksgiving in October get it out of the way and then we have remembrance day and then it's just straight on down the jingle way we it's still love way. you guys we love our american viewers and friends they're great neighbors but we are different yeah <laughs> we love our neighbors 
They're good people. I love going down there to visit, you know? Ah, uh, yes, we miss our American friends. Yep, but we'll get there. Uh, we'll get through all of this right now. We're uh, just gonna get our numbers down here in Manitoba. We're gonna give our hospitals a little bit of a break so that they're not overflowing, and then we'll be back to normal. So we're in lockdown right now. I have released a video, probably just before this or around this, just promoting Manitoba businesses. If you haven't seen it yet, go check it out. I didn't get paid for it or anything, but I do want to support our local economy here right now because they're taking a bit of a hit from these lockdowns. So they're still uh, still doing online shopping. The warehouse one. I am the spokesperson. No. no <laughs> the, unofficial. The, the, unos the, the self proclaimed spokesperson. Unofficial spokesperson. <laughs> They're number one fan, really. Yeah, she loves it there. She loves it. And they make great clothes. I'm wearing their clothes again today. I've been shopping there since I was eight years old. So, the warehouse one, you can go to warehouseone.com. They didn't tell me to say that. I'm just doing it on my own because I love their clothes and Britt loves their clothes. I'm obsessed. Love is an understatement. And we need to help our local businesses. They were made, uh, founded right here in Manitoba, 1977, based in Winnipeg. Anyways, we need to wrap this up, so. Happy day, guys! We got our Christmas lights up. We've established that. We've established that Santa is from Canada. He's but he's from German, Germany! But he's a German-Canadian. <laughs> I've never seen his immigration papers, so. I don't know. It's hard to catch him, right? But I'm just going to tell you this, uh, me and Santa have never been seen in the same room. The real Santa. None of those fake mall Santas. They're just Santa's little helpers. I never thought of that. Yeah. So, there's a thought to think about tonight. <laughs> have a good day, everybody. Have a good night. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit the thumbs up button. Tomorrow we're going to go uh, for a little bit of a drive and explore a little bit. Not much we can do right now, but we'll uh, we'll do what we can. See you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. New videos every day.